Hello, Manfred. Good to see you. Good seeing you Welcome again. to our factory. I'd like to show you around if I could. Yes, please. Let's okay, go. let's go. About 3 million parts come together in this factory. About 215 kilometers of wire in the airplane. Okay, this is a uh, moving line, mm -hmm. and there are about five stations. The first station is what we call systems installation. Mm -hmm. And this is where the forward and aft fuselage sections come together, which are brought from somewhere else. So at this position, it looks like two halves of an airplane. Two halves of an airplane. After the uh, initial assembly, which is what we call systems installation, then they will travel down in a U-shaped uh, okay. pattern, and they will go around and come back towards us uh, uh, in the other direction. What I'd like to show you here is what we call final body joint. They're right where the wing uh, body join is put together with the fore and aft sections of the uh, fuselage. Okay, this is where the airplane comes together for the first time. Okay. And then the landing gear. And it just so happens we have some landing gear right here, so let's go take a look at it. Okay. Landing gear, this is, a little, this is the largest landing gear that's attached to a commercial airplane. This is where the hydraulics connect. And I teach each and every pilot to make sure yeah, that you see the little... to make sure that they're completely seated because if they're not, I've actually had them come off. And you know what I like about the wheel, the gear, once it's in the factory, when it's still in the factory? What's that? It's so clean. It's clean. <laughs> it's so clean, you know? Yeah. yeah. Here's our GE engine, 110,000 pounds of thrust on this airplane. So we've got quite a bit of thrust. The diameter of this engine is equivalent to a narrow body airplane similar to the 737. So it is quite large, but this is the largest engine on a twin freighter in the world. Now the shape of the fan blades, that's very modern. It is modern, and, and basically what they found was that because of the uh, stall characteristics of the air over the blades, that they got much better uh, airflow out of the scimitar, they call it the scimitar blade. And you'll also notice that they're black. Those black areas are made out of composite material. So Very this strong. this is not steel, it's carbon. It is carbon composite. The leading edges, as you can see, are, are uh, aluminum alloy. So, uh, now, for the average person, if they were to look at a 777 up close, which probably doesn't happen very often, it's a very large airplane. It is. Very large it airplane. Is. You know, 350,000 kilogram takeoff weight for your freighter. Yes. Uh, but when you get on the airplane and you sit on the flight deck and you've got 64 meters of airplane behind you, it you don't you don't it, it doesn't feel like that it doesn't feel like that. you feel like you're you're in a sports car that's right it's, it handles beautifully right. it's incredible how large this airplane is when you walk up next to it you know the airports and you see it on the at the gate it's another airplane you walk underneath it and it's just incredibly large there we go all right man from well they put these protective covers on so let's just pull those off okay and uh have a seat that's just to keep your airplane nice and clean. I appreciate that. Before you get it, right now uh, it is in a uh, semi-complete stage of uh, manufacture. You can see the test equipment that's been uh, installed and the large, anything you see that's orange, orange wire on a test airplane means uh, test wire. So essentially what you're looking at here, and you're very familiar with it, is our uh, standard flight deck, uh, you know, uh, triple channel, uh, autopilot with CAT 3B Autoland capability. We've got an electronic checklist that is modifiable by the customer. I know you have your own checklist that we put in there. And then of course, we've got the electronic flight bag. And in the case of uh, Lufthansa Cargo, you have chosen to uh, put this uh, plate here and provide a uh, EFB power switch. So now you will bring your devices in, put them in in this location. You will have the power, which this is a uh, very unique switch to Lufthansa. 
Um, and when, uh, when we meet again in two weeks and test this airplane, we will turn off literally every system in this airplane. Uh, we will turn off the electrics. We will turn off the hydraulics, uh, not at the same time. We will shut down the engines, not at the same time. <laughs> oh, I'm looking very much forward to that. Yes, it's a, it's a two hours of fun and excitement uh, to do the, the flight test. I'll come back in two weeks. <laughs> It'll look different. Then. Contact you. I'm sure you're a good flight over there. 160 heavy. Good day, and uh, I'll see you in a couple hours. That was good. Think of us.